So as you guys saw yesterday, we did get the car all finished up. The only thing that I would change, I was looking around this morning, um, is probably get the Braille lightweight battery because it'll buy us a little bit of room. Um, it's just a really tight fit between this pipe and the battery. And then this pipe is real close to my core support. I had to put some foam down just to make sure it doesn't rub a hole in the aluminum pipe. But other than that, I think everything is really, really nice. And um, I actually did some math. I got some math for you guys. This is coming from, I think it was a diesel website. Let me pull it up. So for each bend, uh, so I don't even, I don't know how to explain this so you guys can see or what, but um, the old setup, we had 56.3 feet um, in total bends in that old setup with all of the two and a half inch piping and two inch piping combined. Um, so that's 3,316 uh, cubic inches. And so we shaved off basically, um, it was about 11 feet in total is what I came up with. So old setup was 56.3, new setup is 45.8, and uh, cubic inches on the new setup is 1,726 versus the 3,316. Um, so, yeah, we dropped down uh, the internal size and the flow restrictions, I guess, by going with wider bends. Uh, so, it should pick up in that area. So, down low, it'll definitely pick up some just because it'll be in boost sooner. Um, the turbo will still be spooling up at the same time, but it'll reach pressure sooner since there is less area to fill. Um, up top is where I'm curious to see if it's gonna, maybe it will be a restriction with the two inch piping, or maybe it will flow better since it doesn't have so many restrictions up top. Um, so we'll see about that. So we made it back uh, and the car feels good. Not really much has changed. Uh, the wastegate still opens a little bit early, so I'm gonna mess with the boost settings. And uh, I think it has a little bit more bottom end power. It just feels a little bit stronger down low, but then the wastegate starts to open and uh, we're making about 14 PSI max. 
and I want that 19. That extra 5 PSI makes a difference, guys, so we'll get there. 